Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last year, Microsoft Edge web browser was updated with a new feature called Web Capture, which basically allows you to capture screenshots of the website that you're browsing in the Edge browser. And then after you've taken your screenshot, you have a few options where you can preview it, save it, share it, and so on. Now, apparently, Microsoft is adding a new option to the Web Capture utility. And at the moment, uh, Web Capture lets you capture a web page longer than the screen by scrolling. But sometimes these web pages have multiple scrollable regions. And on these pages, it is not always possible to scroll those regions. And with the new option to the Web Capture tool, Microsoft has now added a new flag that enables users to select a sub-region to scroll. And this has been added to the Microsoft Edge Canary uh, web browser. It is not available yet in a stable version of Microsoft Edge, only in Microsoft Edge Canary. And the web browser you see open is Microsoft Edge Canary. It is a pre-release unstable version used for testing and experimenting. Now, the a uh, flag you want to enable is called sub scroller area selection and to do this we just go to our address bar and we type in edge colon forward slash forward slash flags that's edge colon forward slash forward slash flags and then in the search field you just type in sub scroller and it will bring up a header called sub scroller area selection which is the flag we want and then you just enable it and you will have to restart the browser to apply the flag. Now, what this does, it says, is when enabled, users will be able to select sections of subscrollers when using web capture or smart copy. So to try this out, what I'm going to do is I am going to go to my settings and I have just opened up a, a menu on the left um, as an example is we have our main scroll and then we have a sub scroll so this is just an easy illustration of what i'm trying to say so you've got your sub scroll area and you've got your main scrolling area on the right now to get to the web capture tool you can go to appearance and then you just enable the button to pop up on the top right of the browser or you can just go to your three dotted menu and you go to web capture and here is the tool and then you just tap on free select and then I'm going to select a section of this to highlight and then I go edit and yeah you can see that it has captured the sub scroller area as well as opposed to the main scroll section that are highlighted it looks a bit clunky at the moment and uh, um, Apparently, it's not quite right yet, as you can see, but apparently I have read that Microsoft should have all these bugs worked out by the time the feature launches in a stable version of Microsoft Edge. So just a handy little feature coming to the Web Capture utility I wanted to share with you today. So you now have the option to, when you are um, capturing a section of a web page, it also has the option now to capture the sub scroller section as well but things don't look quite right as yet and hopefully this will improve in the days and weeks to come i hope you found this video useful once again thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one